such an honor to represent our unit as one of the top units here at seminar. And they need to we only got like I want those girls right there, my soul sisters, to please stand so you can see their beautiful faces and give me a huge round of applause. So proud. This is your achievement, and they're here representing all our consultants across the country. We had our best year yet. And I'm, it's super exciting, and I'm super, super proud of you girls. I'm beyond blessed to have these amazing women in my life. It's a privilege to know you, to work with you, and to do life with you. I love you very much. Thank you. I love you more. Okay, I have a few more quick thank yous, and I want to, first of all, thank God for always showing up. He deserves all the credit. she had to overcome to live out her calling and to give us this incredible opportunity and lifestyle. She relied on her vision, her faith, and her work ethic. She was all in. Are you? That's what I wanted to hear. I want to thank our incredible corporate, corporate staff, everyone, all that they do to support us. They allow us to focus on the people, building relationships while teaching and serving women. And I want to thank our national sales directors for paving the way and for rising to your calling of leadership. We're all better women, better consultants. Yeah, give them a round of applause. Thank you. We're all better women, better consultants, and better leaders because you faced your fears and stepped into your greatness. Thank you. And I particularly I want to thank my favorite National Sales Director Emeritus, Judy Kawicki. She's my mom, as you know. Yay! I know that she has touched a lot of lives, and a lot of lives that are right here in this arena. So do give her a huge round of applause, because I'm so grateful for her. She that. She's an incredible woman, so special. Not only has she been the best mom ever and loved me unconditionally, but she chose to work consistently to be successful in a Mary Kay business, which showed me that anything is possible. I've learned that you cannot transfer a skill that you don't first own, and my mom has shared successful life skills with me, countless others, because she was brave enough to keep going when things got uncomfortable and challenging, which we all have to face. So I want you to remember that, because things can be uncomfortable and challenging this year. You've got to remember this moment in time, your sisters, love and support you and believe in you. She taught me to be the best version of myself by being the best version of herself. My parents have always strived every day to be their best and to continually invest in their personal growth. They didn't tell us how to live our best life, they showed us. They taught us personal responsibility and they allowed us to struggle and make mistakes so we could find ourselves and determine the kind of person we wanted to be in the world. And I'm very grateful for that. I'm blessed to have both my parents here to celebrate our unit's success. I'm so grateful. Thank you. We had quite the fabulous road trip and looking forward to doing it again for Michigan. Um, I love you very much. Thank you for being here. I'm so grateful. I also have my 12-year-old daughter here. I thank God every day that he chose me to be your mom. And I love you more than anything. Brynn is beautiful inside and out. She's fun and fabulous. Uh, and I'm just so grateful that she's here in this positive, faith-filled environment to see that anything is possible with hard work and determination. And whatever she chooses to do in her life, I know she'll be successful. And wherever life takes her, because of the freedom and flexibility that Mary Kay provides, I'll be there. I'll be there. I also need to give a huge uh, shout out and thanks to my weekly prayer warrior sisters. You know who you are. Some are here in the room with us today. And to my Fab Four sisters. Because these phenomenal women have inspired me in ways that I could not have imagined. Iron sharpens iron. And they've helped me deepen my commitment to my faith, to my business, and to my calling. 
They are such high caliber, quality, like-minded, faith-filled women that I'm be beyond blessed to call you my friends. Give them a round of applause. These are some special women. I would take a full of everyone. Honestly, the harder you work to develop your skills and move up the career path at Mary Kay, the greater the perks on all levels. But the girlfriends are like none other. The mutual respect, the positive outlook, the gratitude for this business, the desire to serve the world, and love for our God makes these friendships so rich. And I'm so grateful. As a Mary Kay kid, I've always felt that the most important thing I can tell you is to use your kids as your reason to work your business, not as your excuse not to work your business. My mom was not there for everything growing up, but she was there for everything that was important to me. She provided a lifestyle for us that we would have not had without her fierce determination to work consistently and to succeed. I learned to think big and that I could have anything I wanted as long as I was willing to work for it. Mary Kay used to say that to us all the time. I, I knew Mary Kay and she said that to me too. Just as long as you're willing really to work for it, you can have anything you want, right? I learned to have a positive attitude and to find joy in the journey. I learned to make adjustments but never give up. I learned to work until, until the job is done. I learned to believe in myself. I've been a consultant for 31 years, but 10 years ago when life happened, I had a choice to make. I could either get a job to support myself and my daughter, or I could invest my time and energy building my business for our future. I was so grateful that I chose to make Mary Kay my full-time career. The woman that I've become in the process helps me to be a better daughter, a better mom, a better friend, a better director, a better woman. I learned quickly that I can make money selling our products. Inventory is a privilege. Those early years were tough. There were days that I didn't know how I was going to feed my child, but I had product to sell. There were days that the profit from a mascara sale would get me through. Yeah. I learned that as I worked with women to teach them about their skin and how to use our products to look their best, to feel their best, that my confidence grew right along with theirs. We need to truly appreciate and value what we have to offer women at a Mary Kay party. It is a very special moment in time when we all get to escape our reality and just enjoy being girls. We create a safe, positive, inclusive environment for women to relax and have fun. When a woman looks good, she feels good. When she feels good, she has more confidence, and I believe that a confident woman can do anything. Confidence helps us engage the world. We make better choices, which produce better results. Never underestimate what you have to offer women. Mary Kay asked us to do things, to share the products, to share the opportunity, and to wear a skirt or dress when we represent her. I'm so grateful. I know I'm going to the choir, but I'm so grateful that she raised the bar with our attire because she was wise enough to know that it ultimately helps us feel more confident. We are business women, and we need to look the part. In fact, I encourage you to dress and act like the position on our awesome career path that you aspire to achieve. And I encourage you to start today. Mary Kay always says, say, get it till you make it. You'll get there a whole lot faster thinking and acting like the woman you want to become. It happens as you take yourself seriously. Focus on the activities that will support the results that you want to achieve. Focus on the basics, booking, coaching, selling, and recruiting, and do them over and over and over. I think it was Arnold Palmer, the famous golfer, that said, the more I practice, the luckier I get. <laughs> Success in this business is not about talent or luck. Success is about working every day to improve you. This is a skill-based business, and the more often you book a party, to hold a party, to sell products, to book more parties, and to share what you love about your Mary Kay business, the faster you'll be able to perfect your skills, and then transfer the skills you own to your team, to your unit, and to your national family. Do not compare yourself to anyone because we're automatically comparing your weaknesses to their strengths, and you never win. 
You are meant to run your own race, chase your dreams, and live your best life. God does not give us a dream without fully equipping us to achieve that dream. When you have everything, or you have everything you need right now, within your circumstances, you have everything right now. Be grateful for where you are right now because it's shaped you for a time such as this. A time to decide that you are enough and that you can make different choices to have different results. Stop overthinking and creating problems that don't exist. Start booking, Amen. coaching, selling, and recruiting week in and week out. No excuses. <laughs> You've already seen many, many women here at this seminar that have done just that. They have simply decided to make different choices and to own their power. You were born with a champion inside you and you were created for greatness. This is your year of increase and promotion. This is the year to go for it. And take women with you. That is leading a life of significance. Mary Kay taught us to imagine that every person has a sign around his or her neck that says, make me feel important. Treat yourself the same way. Talk to yourself the way you'd imagine Mary Kay talking to you because you are important. Take care of yourself by taking responsibility for your choices because you are important. You're an ambassador for our products, for our opportunity, and for our Mary Kay lifestyle. We have a very special sisterhood in Mary Kay. We need to cherish it. We need to stay true to our core values, and we need to pass it on. Just like Mary Kay asked us to do because there are women all around us that want to live a life of significance. Focus your energy on being in the space of women. We're known for our personal connection with women. There's a time and a place for social media, but the richness of what we have to offer comes from our personal connection and the exchange of positive energy. Anyone can sell products, but we connect and consult with women to assist them with their needs. We cultivate relationships and create customers for life. My mom recently shared a quote with me. Few will be legends, but we can all leave a legacy. Your decisions followed by your actions are creating your legacy. Today is the day you decide what kind of legacy you want to leave for your family, for your future, and for generations to come. You hold the key. Have a great year. Thank you.